Good morning party people, welcome or welcome back to the channel. I'm Taylor, but I go by T Ramso on all of my platforms and we are back with a weekly vlog. I'm actually getting ready to head out the door because I'm gonna spend some time with my family. I have not seen all of my family since before I left for Greece and we are doing our annual spades tournament. Um, I never really talked about this on my channel or on my social platforms period. Um, for good reason but my grandfather my best friend passed away in 2016 and we just well I came up with the idea last year to honor him by throwing a spades tournament for our family because he taught all of us how to play spades and it was like our favorite pastime together so this is our second annual spades tournament where all of my family comes together um, in his honor and we do like this spades tournament the cookout all the things um, so yeah I'm headed there I was actually supposed to spend the weekend there but honestly I just right now I just I'm still adjusting and I feel like I'm finally finding a routine um, back in the States and I just need a day to kind of reset. I've been working, working, working and like getting to it and I haven't really had a day where I'm just like solely relaxing, resetting like and not playing catch up in some sort of way. So I'm actually going to come back tonight. It's a two hour drive there, two hour drive back, um, but it's worth it to me to go see my family, spend time with my family and drive back home so I can spend my entire Sunday like prepping for the week, meal prepping, just really spending a long, 100% alone time with myself and just resetting, um, which is something I haven't had the time to do. So I felt really bad about that yesterday because I was just debating like riding with my mom and just, you know, doing it that way. But something just told me, and I'm gonna say it's the Holy Spirit, just told me like, girl, drive yourself, get on the road, just do a day trip and call it a day. Um, so that's what's best for me right now. So I'm going to do that uh, before I head out the door. I'm going to be drinking my cold pressed juice. This is the tropical rescue. I'm super excited to try this one because it has like a lot of fruits in it and not so many greens. Um, not to say I didn't like the other ones, but I know this one is going to taste good. So this is a, a cold pressed juice of the day. And then I have my water. Um, I've already taken my like little immunity shot, energy shot. I feel really good, really energized, ready to get on the road. Um, and yeah, I actually have some goodies here for my family from PR that I've gotten. So I'm just going to take this with me and let them choose what they want to. And then whatever they don't choose um, will just be added to the giveaway for y'all. So yeah, I hope you guys are doing well. I hope y'all are doing good. Hope y'all are having, well, by the time you see this, I hope you have an amazing start to your week. I hope you're like resetting and prioritizing yourself and your mental health and all that good jazz. Um, I never showed y'all the full outfit, so let me go ahead and do that. I did change y'all, y'all know how it is. So, um, instead of that black crop top, I just went with this white crop top. It's literally the same one. These mom jeans, uh, high-waisted mom jeans, and then I just have on some Nikes. And then I also changed my earrings as well to these little clear hoops because I feel like it went better with the white. Um, so this is the outfit for the day and we're getting ready to get some gas, gas up and then get on this road. So I will see y'all when I'm at my grandma's house. I call my grandma mom, so when I'm at my mom's house. Hey 
y'all, so I made it to my grandma's house, and my family, well, some of my family's here. Right now, I'm getting ready to taste some chicken. This is my Uncle Mitri. Y'all say hey. <laughs> How y'all doing? <laughs> Any message you want to say? It's hot. It's hot. Oh, that good. look good. Yeah, give me one of them. <laughs> you you gonna mess your blog up? You eat that one now? Yeah. Tell you that right now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, you already made the potato salad? Mm -hmm. Oh, praise God. Oh, why aren't oh, you being so extra? I don't know why she being extra. Thank you. She, she was there. Yeah. This, this is hot. <laughs> <laughs> this is Listen, you know I'm always in the mix. I need a bite. Okay. I need a rest for day today. Hey, Todd been at the house last night. Mm -hmm. That's so good. You did it. Yeah. He said he right. think he had done it. No, that and it's tender. No, that's good. Acting the food, and I heard this loud music. I'm talking can they play music this loud? This late? Thank you, Gandy. Yeah, you actually can. can do that. And, uh, I can taste the rub, too. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let me get a little. Yeah, you did that. Mm -hmm. I ain't gonna hold you. He got a little drum too. I'll be out too. You want something to drink, too? I got, I got a little bit of water. <laughs> <laughs> I got an eeny, meeny, tweeny little water. <laughs> Listen, I'm gonna get that bottle. <laughs> You still on the block eating that chicken like that? Yeah. <laughs> I know you ain't. Why not? It's so good. <laughs> y'all better, better put them things in the oven so people won't see them be eating them up. Mm. Let mm. me hold about two more. Oh my God. How many more you want? Just two. It's sticky. Mm -hmm. But you, gonna, you can take it. Let me give you the other flavor. Let you try that one. I don't know. Like drum, like this is all right, man. Right Meet you. 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 you. Meet 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 you. Mm -mm -mm. Just that barbecue for real. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, it's it's uh, good. I split it with somebody. Hey, it wasn't over YouTube. Huh? YouTube. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. That seasoning. That seasoning. What y'all seasoning? Do? Yeah. That seasoning. What y'all seasoning? I'm about to say it's the rub that make yeah. it like. I can mm. taste it. Yeah. Mm. You got me sucking my fingers. This one don't suck our fingers. Hey. Let me taste some of that potato salad. <laughs> you want a whole drum You want a long, a big one or a drum it? You want a drum it? We, we gonna split. We gonna split one. Oh, this a good right here. Got a drum it. Oh. A drum it. Oh, yeah. We'll, yeah. You can't split, split no. That's what I'm saying. It's a lot of chicken that we got. It is a lot. And Mom trying to Ooh. trying to sell y'all pasta salad. Yeah. <laughs> Bite. Okay, I, I did this bite. I ain't gonna eat it. She's trying to set. I know she's trying to let the devil set her up for the okay. okie dokie. Thank you. Pasta. Okay, so this is oh. a regular barbecue. Yeah, that's her. Mm -hmm. so okay. She's coming out. That don't hurt. That's right. Hot. Hot. <laughs> I see your face. Look at that top chair. Hot. <laughs> Y'all let it cool off. I can't. <laughs> no, that one's sweeter though. I like this hangy, but that one's sweeter. Ooh. Yeah, that's sweet. You're gonna burn your mouth. Yes, hot. Did you think it was St. Patty's Day today? Mm-mm. Get off my mama and her green. She look cute. Oh, you know that's my favorite color. <laughs> Damn it. Green? She already know that. I know her. Why she acting new on you? Right. Oh, y'all still going to leave? Mm-hmm. I'm going to drive all My man, my man, my man. <laughs> leave miss me. I'm going to drive all the way west. I know he was glad to see you. I text him. I was like, I need to make an appointment. I ain't trying nobody. I text him. I was like, I need to make an appointment. He was like, I don't even know who this is. I ain't seen you in so long. <laughs> I said, if you miss me, just say that. Listen, he had me. Don't be filming me. I don't want to be on no YouTube or, or TikTok or, or tactic or whatever. <laughs> She said tactic. No, she didn't. Oh, God. No, she Learning your secrets to your banana pudding. I don't want to be on that camera. Mom make a banana pudding, y'all. And look like she just throwing them. Yeah, she just throwing them together. I be placing my cookies. Uh -uh. She normally do that, too, yeah, Archie. I don't know why she First of all, I sure didn't feel like making y'all no banana I pudding. Let's start there. Than. She just throw it. It's going to so good. She had like she don't want to make it today. She show it. Watch her mind, too. She ain't going to cut me. I say it's working because you, you was too off. Yeah, like a I, model. <laughs> I, I said, oh, I, 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 I
I told Mitri, you better watch it because she got a switch back. Okay. And that's exactly what he told me the other day. Tell me, girl, you switching again. Yep. <laughs> I told her, I said, Miss Miss. Don't let put on a little outfit. All right. Go uh -huh. to the store. Uh -huh. Right. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Put some heels on. The only thing I didn't try yet was my heels. Y'all ain't had heels on me three years. Yeah. Ooh. It ain't right time. I'm about to say, yeah. wait till you finish and then, like, slowly yeah. work your way back. Well, once yeah. you get back we'll, in the we'll heels. Yeah. Yeah. I got me some heels. A little concert outfit. Yeah. yeah. Skin. Yeah, <laughs> back out. <laughs> I, I, I feel you now. I feel you. She's never been to a Beyonce concert. I said, girl, you got to go. Mm. Beyonce. Beyonce. And them it's an experience. You saw that latest picture with her and her two girls. Yeah, I did. Mm -hmm. Look at beautiful. Blue looked just like her. Blue looked like she's like gorgeous. The little yeah. one too. Yeah, now. Ruby. Yeah, but I was stepping. Jennifer gave him to me. <laughs> you <laughs> couldn't find her next step. <laughs> Jennifer bought some potent I'm, gummies. I almost beat my juice out of <laughs> First of all, don't be giving my grandma no weed gummies. You know she ain't never done no drug, <laughs> drug, drug. She ain't had weed since 1980. <laughs> Don't get rid of that. Was it that year? <laughs> <laughs> Don't confess nothing. <laughs> we all grown now. It's past the statute of limitations. It's past that. Yeah. Yeah. Sure, it's not legal. <laughs> it is legal. <laughs> oh, Jesus. It's been a minute. <laughs> you took some? What, the gummies? Some gummies? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You ain't touching them again? Mm -hmm. She said, uh uh. She said, uh, uh, I can't do that. <laughs> I should be getting my mommy and all that. She's like, I ain't taking them no more. I'll try one. <laughs> <laughs> I should try one. They they you want back. Back. one for the pain, too? Yeah, they do. They do. They do. Take right for bed. Go to yeah, sleep. I'm about to say, you go to sleep. Good. Ooh, yeah. Just like when they called me out. <laughs> and they was like, why you why you bunk over the sink like that when you brush your teeth? Granny do it. You do it. How you Mom do it? How you do it? I do the same thing. I, do, I, I do. didn't notice I did it till Nate called me out. I, I was like, why do you bunk over? Stand up. I do the same thing. I do it. <laughs> I do the same thing. And it's like a specific way. And yeah. she mimicked me. And I was like, oh, she ate me up. Because <laughs> your family, that's a family. No, family. it's learned. Like, it I learned. do it unconsciously. Mm -hmm. And then she, when she saw my mama do it, she said, oh, that's where you get that from. <laughs> Yeah, like stand up. up. Stand I'll put up. My arm right there. Cause I don't you do that stuff to fall on me. Yeah. That's why I can get I don't know. I don't want to get on the clothes I, and stuff. Inevitably I, it gonna fall. But I couldn't tell you why I do it. Oh. I can't tell you. I, that's you not my just, reason. I just do it. You saw it. Yeah. When I told you how to brush your teeth, you tell you. Right. <laughs> and it's like, why am I doing why? I don't have to do that. I can see up. She was right at the same thing. Right. Yeah. <laughs> But you're right. It's amazing how you learn things from your family. Mm -hmm. Like even the way I clap in church. Oh yeah. <laughs> that's a, that's a, uh, yeah. Like, why do I do that? Yeah. I have no reason to do that. Yes, oh, no. I mean, Dorothy. <laughs> and you know, some people come out here. Yeah. I don't do that. You clap your like. Is that not what I just did? That's Is that not what I just did? That's what you did. Or, Oh, I be I be like, oh god. Watch him, mom. <laughs> like, I just don't even want to do nothing. No more. I just want to sit here. Cause what? You old so blessed. Your praise is your blessing. It sure is. It is. It is. It is. It is. Was up, but I just went home and got up. I was like, this is ridiculous. Auntie, leave my grandma alone. Hold up. Come be my grandma. Okay, I saw you finna say something. I wasn't gonna say nothing. Yeah. I wasn't gonna say nothing. Got enough juice in it. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You think so? I think it so. should be. Oh, you don't shit. And then whipped cream on top. Yeah. Mine ain't changing. I'm still five. I was two. on five one. Went from five two to five one. I'm five two. Mm -hmm. My spine, they said I lost some Yeah, yeah, yeah. How you do your lips, Tasha? Tasha? <laughs> Stop following up your mom. Right. <laughs> oh, it, mm. it, it smells good. really good, too, yeah. Ooh. It smells delicious. Somebody might want to kiss you. Mm. Mm, yeah. You still got your mouth? Not today. No. <laughs> <laughs> still got what? Come back. You still got your mind. I said no. She said, I mean, no. <laughs>
And see what you do, Tasha? Once you have your dinner, and you want to put some lipstick in, you just hold it up like this first. <laughs> 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 you don't even know the brand. You, you literally don't even know the brand. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Tell her how to pronounce it. Miss Hero, pronounce it. Oh, yeah. What does YSL stand for? E. St. Laurent. Come on, okay, mama. Yeah. Come on, mama. E. St. Laurent. Yeah. yeah. I'm not ignorant. Yeah. 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 My grandma slides. Who on this one? This is yours or Tasha? No, this one, but that one, man. I'm that is that Tasha. No, I got mine in my hand. Oh. No, the other Tasha. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Got that camera on me. You so How are you just going to turn my camera around? <laughs> what grandma. is this? My grandma. Say, is that a lip liner? No, that's a... That's a concealer. Is that a concealer? Mm-hmm. I should like them green nails. Thank you, mommy. <laughs> two of wait, each number. Say hey. Whoever the two. Say hey. Um, the same hey. Thing. You, gotta, hey. you gotta wait. Say hey. hey. There you go. <laughs> Where's mommy? Mama, wait. Look at the food. Mama, How you already got the thing in your hand? You ain't want a jack thing. I'm walking around. <laughs> 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 you get the He ain't want a thing. Look at this, y'all. He got the trophy in his hand. It's not yours. You ain't playing every game. He said you want to play. Unless you gonna, unless you gonna go around and modeling it. Right. These are the trophies, y'all, for the space tournament. <laughs> They're actually engraved. I don't know. I just y'all see? There you go. Sack Erickson Space Tournament. Yeah. 2023, second year. It's gonna be mine, right? Y'all, the space tournament just started. I'm not playing. I'm the photographer, videographer. I got something to put in. Let the games begin. Oh, this is my song. This is my wedding song. great day yesterday with my family um, as y'all saw the space tournament it was getting serious okay but I got to spend some really good quality time with my family that's my first time seeing them since I've been back in the States and we just had a really really good time like I said before I did not stay I came on back home and when I tell y'all that was like the easiest breeziest drive back in there that I've ever had in my entire life like I was meant to come back home and I had a great drive like it was just my music was hitting, 
like everybody was being safe on the road like I just felt like there were just so many signs I was like you need to go back home so I got back last night around like 10 o'clock and then of course showered and then I crashed and then today we are doing our Sunday reset so the skin is glowing I've done like my ext extensive Sunday skincare routine of like exfoliation and all that jazz um, I actually have my last load of laundry in the dryer right now I wash my sheets and um, currently finishing washing my blanket that I had to like cuddle with um, and I made breakfast watched church cleaned up now I'm getting ready to make dinner so I'm just gonna make a little salmon bowl I do have some leftover rice from last week for making that power bowl um, which was so delicious it was 10 out of 10 I don't know if I was vlogging that day yeah I'm not sure if I vlogged that day but this is what the power bowl looked like and it was 10 out of 10 I'll leave a link to the recipe for y'all I didn't use my recipe but if you want to try it I'll find a recipe that is like similar to what I use um, 10 out of 10 great for like weight loss trying to add protein and just super filling too so I'm just gonna do a quick salmon bowl. I have leftover rice. I actually have cucumbers too. I'm gonna make a quick yum yum sauce and then sear this salmon on the stove instead of the oven. Um, and yeah, y'all. I'm probably gonna read a little bit and then watch a movie or something. I do have a Bible study a little bit later today. So um, yeah, what else? Tomorrow, what are we doing? I just really need to prep for filming this brand deal. But outside of that, like I'm trying to get everything done today. So yeah, I feel like today was like a super slow and productive day, which we all need. Like I said, I really had to choose myself today and yesterday and not spend a weekend with my family, just spend a day because your girl has been on go ever since she got back and I needed time to just sit with myself. I am an introvert, so, and I just really love being alone. Like I love my alone time. I love like, quietness like do y'all hear that this is my favorite sound in the whole wide world nothing like i love being by myself so i just wanted a day to just kind of be with myself reflect journal read watch a movie cook like and just kind of get my spirit ready for these next few weeks so yeah that's what i did today and i'm feeling really really good about it yeah i hope you guys are doing well i hope Y'all are sticking to your goals, choosing yourself, prioritizing yourself. Sometimes that means saying no or kind of going back on your word and readjusting. Um, and always remember, you always have the right to change your mind at any given moment. You can change your mind at any given moment. Okay? Okay. So I'm going to get to cooking this simmer really quick and making a dinner. And yeah, just relaxing. This will be your early... This will be your early dinner. It's only 4.33 right now. So yeah, it's only 4.33. I may get my mom to bring me back some banana pudding. Yeah, my grandma banana pudding is too good. <laughs> and I don't even like banana pudding. Like, I'm not even somebody that likes it. But my grandma's, I know everybody says that. But like, my grandma's, <laughs> my mom's, her banana pudding is 10 to another 10. Um, so yeah, let me go ahead and get to the cooking. I'm either gonna watch a vlog or just play some music and vibe out. But yeah, y'all. I hope y'all are doing well. Also, I'm rambling, but I do want to say this before I get off. Thank you guys so much. Y'all may not know my Instagram or follow me on Instagram. If you don't, please do. We just hit 87K on Instagram and I never take any person that follows me for granted. I know that it, behind each number is a person in their own story. So I just wanna say thank you so much for supporting me, for joining this journey of life with me. Um, yeah, and just rock with me because you guys do not have to, it is a choice. So thank y'all so much. If you follow me on Instagram, if you're one of the party people on Instagram, thank you so much. Let's keep growing together. Um, we are on the road to 100K, but I'm not really putting too much emphasis on the number because I know whatever God gives me is what I need and what I can handle at that time, that season of my life. So I'm past the point of trying to push a certain number on myself or on a timeline or on my journey. 
I'm just at a point where it's like whatever God sees fit for me to have at that very time, I know I'm supposed to have it and I have the means and the tools to manage it. So super grateful for y'all. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, let's get to cooking. Hey y'all, happy Monday. I've been pretty much filming and editing all day. I did get that campaign done, so we love to see that. Also the braids, it was for a braid refresh for a hair company and my braids look really fresh and they smell really good. Like 10 out of 10, y'all go. Well, I don't know if it'll be out by the time this vlog is out. If it is, I'll leave it in the description bar. If it's not, I won't. Um, but also I started a new program today, a workout program called Elite Shred. I've mentioned her, the trainers programs on here before, but I'll leave it in the link below. It's an eight week program to shred. And then I'm gonna follow up one of her glute programs. Um, by the time y'all watch this, the sale won't be going on anymore, but she's having a sale on all of her programs for $20. So yeah, if you're interested, she's coming out with new programs by the time this video comes out. So go cop a new program and do one of them with me because I'll be on this for the next eight weeks. And then the glute program is another eight weeks. So for the next 16 weeks, we'll be on the program. Yeah, her programs are amazing. She's certified, like she knows what she's doing. And she's like really passionate, dedicated to honing in her craft and 10 out of 10, love her. Um, I'm in the kitchen. Again, we're gonna be in the kitchen a lot during this <laughs> shred. I'm about to make some roasted potatoes and Brussels sprouts to go along with that salmon I made yesterday. Y'all saw that. Um, and yeah, I hope y'all are having an amazing start to your week. This is gonna be a good week. I just feel it. I'm claiming it. I'm claiming it for y'all too. So, child, let's get into making these potatoes. Let me wash my hands because I know somebody's going to be like, you just scratched your head. You're not eating these potatoes. You're not. <laughs> Let me stop. Anyway, let's get into making these potatoes real quick so we can eat. It's almost 6 o'clock. I ate at like 2, 33 o'clock, I think. Because filming took a little bit longer than I expected, but... We got it done, we got to submit it, which is all that better. So let's get into it. sprouts <laughs> I'm gonna have to start doing it fun so fact mm -hmm. fun fact I don't like Brussels sprouts but my mom grilled them or what'd you say charred them mm -hmm. charred them sauteed them. them charred them a little bit and then added some parmesan on top that's the key. Cheese and sour cream make everything better, but I ain't, well, I ain't gonna say I ain't supposed to be eating cheese, but cheese in moderation for sure. Um, that's all I wanted to say. <laughs> you wanna tell them about your day? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Did you have a good day? <laughs> Did you have a good day? Yeah. I had a long list of stuff I need to get done. Today. Right, but you always 
tell me the long list, I figure you might want to tell them. No. Mm-hmm. Or just me? Ain't nobody business, just you. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> I'll check in with y'all later. This is literally the best and the worst feeling in the world, taking your makeup off. Best feeling because to me, it's like the equivalent of taking your bra off after a long day. And I don't really wear bras anymore. But also the worst feeling because when you have a really, really good makeup day, it's like, dang, I gotta take this beat off. Like I ate today, I ate y'all up today. Oh, like, I mean, I ate the grill stuff today. And now I gotta take it off. But I'm using this uh, Lip Bar Total Meltdown Makeup Remover Balm. As y'all can see, I, I love this stuff. It's almost empty. I'm excited to try the new one from Milk Makeup. They sent it to me before I left for Greece. I also really like the Notorium. I think the Notorium one is my favorite. It's this, the ginseng cleansing balm. Um, I think that was my favorite. This one is okay. They have better product, other other products that are better than this. Um, and then the next one I'm gonna try is the Milk Makeup Hydro Makeup Remover. But for now, I'm gonna use what I have. And if you don't use a makeup remover, you definitely should. We shall all be double cleansing in these streets. Y'all look at this. Oh, so good. This literally breaks down all of your makeup. When I take this washcloth and wipe it all off, brand no cheap. Can y'all see that? All the makeup off. Oh. Whew. So much better. I'm about to go hop in the shower and I will talk to y'all tomorrow because it has been a long day. Okay? Okay. Good morning, beautiful people. I hope y'all are doing well. It is hump day, it's Wednesday, and I'm headed out for some errands. So the first stop, we're going to get a wax because it's about that time, girl. Okay? <laughs> it's about that time. Um, I need to stop by Target, I need to stop by Walmart to pick up some things for dinner tonight. Um, and then Target just to pick up, Target to pick up a few toiletries. Um, quick little OOTD. Y'all know I'm coming with the basics. This shirt is from H&M. I don't know where I got these jeans from, honestly. I just have on some clear sandals. This bag is San Rev. Um, this bracelet is Ana Luisa. These earrings are Hoop Mob. And this was gifted from my best friend DJ. So shout out to him. Thank you, Woogie. Um, and yeah, I'm about to head out. About to go see my girl Luna. Y'all, my waxer, the, the way I describe her to people is that she's sunshine. Like, the lady is a literal sunshine. Like, I love her. We always spill tea when we together. So I might actually film her <laughs> my wax. Um, because Luna, Luna gonna make sure she get the tea from you, girl, okay? I already know. I have not seen Luna since I left for Greece. Uh, since before I left for Greece. And Luna always wanna know about my dating life. Luna always wanna know, like, what's going on. And Luna always telling me I'm bigger than life itself. Like, Luna just thinks I'm gonna be this big star and, like, this huge celebrity. And Luna just believes in me, girl. And I be needing that energy. So, we're gonna go see Luna. Run, some few, run a few errands. Come back. Start prepping for dinner. I actually have laundry going right now. I need to change it. Um, and yeah, I probably do a little bit of editing before I end my day. Today is like an out day. Yesterday I spent all day editing. I didn't talk to y'all. Um, and then the day before that, I spent pretty much all day filming and editing. So today is just like get out the house day, let the sun touch some skin, touch the grass, you know, just be out and about. I got a little cute. I was gonna put on makeup, but I was just like, girl, the skin is skinny. Okay, I don't need no makeup. I don't need no makeup, and that's a blessing in itself. We praise God for that. So, yeah, I hope y'all are doing well. I hope y'all are powering through the week. And are y'all on y'all Zoom? Because I've been on my Zoom. I ain't missed a workout. I ain't had a cheat meal. I've been on it. And, girl, I look good. I wish I could show y'all for real, but, you know, we got to keep it cute. We got to keep it sanctified, okay? But 
Yeah, I'm eating y'all up. Y'all just wait. Week one is almost done on my program. We got seven more weeks to go before we start a new program. I'm finna eat y'all up. Eat y'all up. I'm about to eat y'all up. Anyway, let's get ready to go. And, oh, I need to change this laundry first. Then we can go. Hey, y'all. Child. Let me wash my hands. Please tell me why I saw was giving a little ghetto today. Between people not being able to dry, me not being able to find lotion. Is Nivea having a shortage? Because I had to go to three stores to find lotion. And as a black person, being ashy is a sin. I can't go out like that. I ain't never been ashy my entire life. Y'all ain't never gonna catch me ashy. And that's just crazy to me. And why is everything so exp You know what? God, we thank you. I ain't gonna complain. I'm gonna give y'all a little haul. I wasn't gonna film with Luna, but child, we got into some tea that need to be kept private. Okay? Period. Um, but it was really good seeing her. We got our wax grow. We're feeling fresh, feeling new. Just in time. Yeah. Okay, anyway. <laughs> um, quick little haul. So I went to Target and Walmart. Um, my razor actually broke. So I have the fillings for the razor, but I don't actually have the razor itself. So got a flamingo razor. We love flamingo in this household. Got some tampons. These are the organic L tampons. I've been using these for, I think, three, three-ish years, two, three years. Um, got my secret deodorant. I don't know if Y'all watched the unboxing. I said I was going to try that um, natural deodorant. Mm -mm. I tried it for like two days. The first two days, I smelled amazing. The third day, I smelled so funky. I ain't never been that funky in my entire life. So we're going to stick with what we know. Thank you. Um, I got some Bonza pasta. It's like the protein pasta. I'm going to be making this tonight. I got some pesto because we're going to need this for tonight's recipe. I did get some rice cakes because this is a cute little snack, a pre-workout snack in the morning. Um, because I go to the gym before I eat like a full breakfast, I try to eat something. So it's been yogurt and berries this week. Um, and so I'm gonna actually do two of these with some bananas and honey and peanut butter before I work out. It's like the perfect blend of everything you need before a workout and it will absorb and digest quickly so you'll get the fuel you need before your workout so pro tip if you need something quick to eat before your workout um got some bananas i did get a little parmesan cheese and i got some steamed broccoli and some green beans that's from target and then from Walmart, floss sticks. I've been using regular floss because Grease didn't have floss sticks, so I've just been using the leftover floss that I've had from there, but it's time to get back to the floss sticks because it's easier. I got some Nivea because dang! I had to go to three stores to find some Nivea. They want the, y'all, after this I ain't gonna say nothing about the lotion. 21.29 for a little bit of bottle of lotion. Absolutely not. Abso absolutely not. This was ten dollars from uh, Walmart, and it's the size that I wanted—the the really big one. Thank you. Crazy. And then I just got some mouthwash because we need to keep it cute. We need to keep it real cute, just in case, you know. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, that's it. I'm about to eat some lunch, y'all. I am so sleepy. Lord, please let the sleepy spirit come off of me. I'm about to actually eat this. Um. Factor meal, so let me go and grab that real quick. Okay, so this meal is the Baja Salmon. It is, ooh, 670 calories, 34 grams of protein. Um, yeah, this actually has cauliflower rice, broccoli, and jalapeno lime crema. So you put the crema on top of the salmon. This is what it looks like. So this is what I'll be eating for lunch real quick. And then it's like back to work. So, quick little haul. I'm gonna put these groceries away. 
Um, and then once I finish work for a little bit, I'm actually going to start prepping for dinner so we can do that together. And before y'all say anything, I do want to say I will give y'all a cute little montage in the grocery store and in Target and all that good jazz. But today just was not giving that. It was giving get in, get out. And I really don't like vlogging in my car either because I just feel like it's too loud and I have to yell and I genuinely don't like speaking very loudly. Like, I have a very, very, I don't wanna say low voice, but I just naturally don't speak loud. Um, unless I'm with my family, y'all have seen, I have a very loud family. So if you don't yell, you won't be heard. Uh, but naturally, I'm just, I don't talk loud. So yeah, I'm not gonna be screaming at y'all just cause we in the car. So I just want to put that out there. I don't know why I felt led to say that, but I did. Also, I want to share the verse of the day with y'all because I never actually like go in the Bible app to read the verse of the day. I actually go read my Bible in the mornings, um, depending on what book I'm in. But today's verse is here. It came across my screen. I was like, oh, I need to share that. Um, it is James 1 and 12. God will bless you if you don't give up when your faith is being tested. He will reward you with a glorious life just as he rewards everyone who loves him. Ooh, ain't that good? Like in this life, our faith will be tested. Like that is a guaranteed fact. But we have to not give up. And there's another scripture that goes, um, it's Romans 5, 3 and 5. Not only that, but we rejoice in our suffering, knowing that suffering produces endurance. Endurance produces character. Character produces hope. And hope does not put us to shame because God's love has been poured into our hearts through the Holy Spirit who has been given to us. Like when you're being tested and you don't give up, God will bless you with a glorious life. The book literally says that. This is to build our endurance. Suffering and hardships and trials is literally to build our endurance and building our endurance is gonna build our character and building our character actually helps us to be able to share our testimony because if we don't go through anything, we won't have nothing to share. We won't have anything to motivate and inspire other people. So like everything in your life, everything that God is taking you through and bringing you through is literally so he can get all the glory at the end of the day, but it's adding to your story. And every little part is important y'all, like every single little part. So always remember that in the back of your head, like all of it is literally working together for your good, but you have to build endurance. Just like you have to build endurance in the gym, you have to build endurance to your faith because faith is a muscle. If you don't work it, you ain't gonna have nothing. And it's okay if you start off with a little mustard seed because that's all it really takes. But we don't want to be baby Christians. We, wanna be on, want, we, wanna, we don't want to be on milk for the rest of our life, right? We want to be on solid food. We want to keep growing, right? So I just want to share that with y'all. Always remember, I love you, God loves you more. And get in that book. Get in that book daily. Cause it'll read you back. Okay? Okay, I'll talk to y'all later. Also, I'm really craving a soda and I've cut that out. And I don't know if it's gonna be a permanent thing or not. But this, I haven't had a craving since I started this shred, but this Limoncello LaCroix, I'm telling y'all, Limoncello LaCroix, with lemonade mio i don't know who i need to speak to to make this a partnership i need them to collaborate and just come out with this drink all by itself like this oh 10 out of 10. These two together, y'all, I would not lead y'all astray. This right here, these go together real bad. Real bad. Ooh, that just gave me all the fix I needed. That's all I wanted to say. <laughs> hey, y'all. So, I don't even know if I would call that a nap. I was somewhat in and out of sleep, so much so that my, I just love my little UPS man. My UPS man didn't even ring the doorbell. He must have saw me from the window with that book in my hand. Sleep! Woo, God. Sleep. Y'all, he always ring the doorbell because we always have a cute little exchange. I tell him have a great day, you know, be blessed, all that good stuff. That man did not ring that doorbell. He must have seen me from that window and said, I ain't gonna wake baby girl up. I ain't gonna do that to her. She looks so peaceful. I know, y'all, I know my head was cocked back, mouth wide open. Anyways, 
it's time for dinner. This is what our dinner situation is looking like. I have all my ingredients out ready to go. This should be a super quick and easy meal. We're making creamy, um, what is it? We are making creamy pesto chicken pasta with broccoli. And like I showed you before, I'm using the protein pasta, the peanut pasta that's made from chickpeas um, to kind of supplement the regular pasta. I already got my seasonings together. We just gonna vibe out. I'm actually probably gonna go get my speaker and just wake myself up a little bit. Honestly, not even wake myself up because I promise you I'm going to take a shower and going right back to sleep because these workouts, I've been trying to wake up a lot earlier to go to the gym so I can start my day a lot earlier and just be as productive as possible. But who y'all tired, boss? I'm tired and these workouts are kicking my hiney. That cardio today, I had the high. You know how you have runners high? Cause I did run today. I had a high after, but I came crashing down so fast. So once I eat, I'ma shower and I'ma knock out y'all. Six o'clock, seven o'clock, your girl be in the bed watching the Tyler Perry play. Sleep by 10. Amen, amen. So let's go ahead and vibe out. Pretty much, it's just welcome to my cooking channel at this point. Cause this whole vlog is just cooking. I'm in here slaving over this stuff. Call me Mama Tay, cause I'm feeding y'all. Okay. The recipe for this um, the recipe for this pasta will be down in the description bar below. All jewelry, clothing, all that good stuff. Check the description bar first. It's probably gonna be there. Mm-hmm. Yep. It's gonna be there. So let me get started and stop talking to y'all. beautiful plate here I got some broccoli some creamy pesto chicken pasta I'm gonna do like an official taste test of course I've been tasting it throughout like as I've been cooking it and it's good but I want to taste it all together so let's get into it Let's try body so it can be better serving for you. Amen. Why y'all didn't tell me to pray? Anyway, y'all made this recipe. It is. Mm hmm. Oh yeah, I'm going to sleep. All the flavor is here. 30 minute, little 45 minute. In the kitchen, boom, boom, bam, bam. And it's so flavorful, y'all. I'm not even joking. It is very, very flavorful. Like, I think we only use like three seasonings. Mm-hmm. And you get all the goodness without the heaviness of actual pasta. This is the, the what is it, bonza pasta, the chickpea pasta, protein pasta. Mm-hmm. And it's low in calories. Mm-hmm. So we got our protein with the chicken, even in the chickpeas with extra fiber, and we got our broccoli. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna enjoy this and I will talk to y'all tomorrow. Good morning, beautiful people. I hope you guys are doing well. Happy Friday. 
it is another day that the Lord has made and we are glad in it, okay? Okay. Um, I just got done with a workout, eating breakfast and showering and just getting ready for my day. And I wanted to quickly show you guys some of this week's PR. I did unbox a good bit of it, but I did want to go ahead and share it with y'all. So this week we got some perfumes, which I'm super excited about. I'm actually wearing one of them today. So I got these three, Lancome Idol. This one is the Aura. This one is the Now. And there's another one they sent me. I think it's called Clean. And I gave that one to my mom. But I'm currently wearing the Now, Now Idol. Lancome now um and it smells so good the aura is my favorite this one has salted vanilla in it and this one has undertones of vanilla i'm a vanilla girl like through and through one thing i'm gonna do is wear some vanilla and so the salted vanilla just settles a lot better on my skin um but this one is just cute for every day i'm not leaving the house today and i really enjoyed wearing it yesterday when i tested it out so this is going to be like kind of like an everyday scent and then I might wear this this weekend. We're heading out of town tomorrow. We're, we're supposed to be heading out of town. We'll get into that later. Anyway, I might wear this this weekend. It smells real scrumbly on shits. Yes, girl. Um, but yeah, this one smells absolutely amazing. So if you are like a very floral kind of clean scent girl, I would, I would really recommend this one. The Now, it just smells so good. But... The other one that I gave to my mom smelled a little bit like church mother. And I don't think I'm going to ever be at the age of stage where I want to smell like church mother. You know? And that's no disrespect to the church mothers. Y'all be out here doing it. That's just not my cup of tea. I want to smell a sensual for the Lord. You know what I mean? Amen. Okay. <laughs> so I'm wearing this one today. I might wear this one tomorrow. Um, so thank you to... So thank you to Lancome for sending those over. And then we got some new hair goodies. Y'all know I am your hair inspo. One thing about me, I'm going to keep my hair done. And ain't going to keep it done. Yeah. Um, so I don't want to mispronounce this, y'all. Biolage, biolage, biology. They sent they over some products. Uh, this is for their tea tree line, I believe. This is the strength shampoo um this is a scalp sink for danger control yeah need that fight scalp scaling itching and flaking okay so we have that is it focusing okay there we go then they sent over this strength recovery conditioner and then they sent over this all-in-one multi-benefit spray for all hair types now what's the benefits? I don't know. I've been looking for the benefits since they gave it to me, but it's a leave-in conditioner, y'all. Um, so I'm gonna try this on my braids. My braids are actually pretty fresh in condition. Like I said, I had a campaign to do to refresh my braids. So my braids are pretty fresh and I actually oiled my scalp yesterday. So I'll probably use this leave-in sometime this weekend and I'll let y'all know in the next vlog how I liked it and if it's heavy or not or if I recommend it or not. Beauty Bio welcomed me into their family. So, so excited. Thank you to Beauty Bio. This is a voluminizing, what? This is a volumizing lip serum. I'm gonna try this today because recently for some reason, I've been getting so many compliments on my lips and nothing has changed y'all. Vaseline. Um, this is the oil free calming gel cream. This is the eyeliner, it's a brightening serum, eyeliner concentrate and deep puffing tool. Oh yeah. I don't really suffer with dark marks under my eyes or dark spots under my eyes, but I do suffer with puffiness. Both of my parents passed that gene down. Like, I look so swollen in the morning. This is a weightless oil control and redness repair toner. Now, I don't struggle with no redness. Not with all this melanin. But that's beautiful. Um, and then they sent over this complete hydration facial. So in it, there is an extraction tool, which I will be using in the next vlog um, because I really want y'all to see it. This is what it should look like after like all the dirty water comes out. Well, all the dirt from your face comes out once you use it. 
And so I'm super excited to try that out and just kind of, you know, clear all the gunk out of my skin because my skin has been really flourishing lately, but we can always make it better. We can always make it better. Then we have, I, I, I hate to be one of those people like, I can't pronounce this because I am very well read and very literate. They, they, these people set up some some night oil, some retinol night oil, and we are very grateful and thankful. Thank you to that company. <laughs> um, and then it is a small woman-owned swimsuit company. So party people, I will leave the link in the description bar to go support this new and upcoming swim uh, swimwear line. And they sent. Ooh. This is the packaging, y'all. Get it to it. I love small own businesses. I love small own businesses. Cause the, the one thing, the, oh, I can't even talk. One thing they gonna do is get the packaging right. They gonna get it right. Endorphin Swim. I hope I'm pronouncing that right as well. Um, they sent me their swimsuit in black. They have this swimsuit in like four or five different colors. Um, if she gives me a discount code as well, because I know we talked about that, so you guys will be able to try it at a discount, um, I would definitely leave that in the description bar below for you guys as well. I'm actually going to try this swimsuit on for y'all because you're going to start a wax, so we're good to go. Um, <laughs> and see how it fits so I can give her any feedback. Not that to say that my opinion matters, but she has her feedback, so if I have any, I definitely want to give it back to her. So let's go try this on. Hear me when I say this. Courtney Gras! Courtney Gras! Courtney, girl, you did that, girl. You did it because, y'all, the way this material feels like skin, I can't even describe like what the material is. But I'm gonna try to get as close as I can so you guys can like see it. It is the most comfortable material I've probably ever put on my body. Listen, she ain't paying me to say none of this. This is for free. This is good. Look, look at how much it can stretch. Like I feel like. If I were to be pregnant right now, I would still be able to wear a small. Does that make sense? Not to say that's my testimony, but I just feel like it would just stretch so well. Uh, and then get into the back. Okay, so y'all see the front? It gives, and y'all know I'm a one piece girl. I live in one piece. One piece is just give for my body. Get into the back. Get into the back. I don't need y'all getting no free show enough. You know what I mean? But get into, just get into the back. The back. Oh, Courtney ate the girls up with this. Courtney! Courtney! Yes, ma'am! Oh, yes, ma'am. You did that, bruh. Mmm, -hmm. this is about to be my go-to swimsuit. Woo! Because you can really make it family-friendly. I can, I can go ahead and, and scoot it over my booty like this, you know. But you can make it, mm-hmm, for a little vacation, right? But overall, I rate this like a solid 10 out of 10. It is super comfortable. It is super stretchy. Um, for me personally, I would like the straps just a little bit tighter. But that's a personal thing. That's not a them thing. Um, yeah. The straps stay in place. They do stay in place. They don't like move or anything. But for me, I would just like it maybe like an inch tighter. Because I just like it feel really sucked in everything I wear. But that's not a them thing. That's, that's a personal thing. So... Yeah, if she give us a discount code, I'm giving it to y'all because y'all need to go run to support our girl. She wanted to party people, run to support our girl. This is a woman owned small business based out of California, period. Yeah, that's it y'all. Hey y'all, so it's a little bit later and we actually just got another PR package so I wanted to open it on camera with y'all, but also I wanted y'all to come with me to this meeting, this um, milk makeup welcome call. They reached out earlier this week and asked me to join this welcome call. Um, and I think it has like the executive, some some important execs that are going to just like kind of talk about um, new products or I guess what they look for when they're trying to collaborate. Um, and I honestly don't know if we're supposed to wear makeup to this call. I, child, I don't know. I'm giving, they're going to get what I'm giving. Um, so I love milk makeup. Y'all know I love the Hydro Grip Primer. I love the brow, um, the brow gels, like micro brow gel, and their mascara is 
chef's kiss. I have baby lashes, which is why I have to buy lashes because mine are non-existent. And their mascara is literally the only mascara that actually makes me feel like I don't have to wear lashes. So, super excited to see what this call is all about. Um, and I want y'all to see a little behind the scenes of that. Just in case some of you who are watching aspire to be influencers or just think it may be interesting. So, let's go ahead and open up this last little PR package. And then... We are going to say goodbye for the week because we start a new week. Tomorrow, like I told y'all before, I'm supposed to be going out of town for the day. It's not confirmed yet. We'll see. Ciao. I don't know if I'm stepping into my dating era or not, but this will determine if I am or not. <laughs> we gonna see. We gonna see. Okay, this is from Paul Mitchell. We love Paul Mitchell. This is their lavender, this is their tea tree collection. This is their lavender mint moisturizing conditioner. This is their, ooh, tea tree special detox foaming salt scrub for your scalp. Oh, I'm definitely using that as soon as I take these braids out. Then they have a tea tree special detox kombucha rinse. Okay, Bob Mitchell. Bob Mitchell say, I'm coming for the girls. Is it focusing? And then we have, I'm pretty sure this is a shampoo. Yep, the lavender mint shampoo. So I am excited to try Paul Mitchell. Uh, my hairdresser used Paul Mitchell on my hair and it responds really well to that. Thank you so much to Paul Mitchell and the Paul Mitchell team. Um, now let's hop on this call. Once I hop on this call, I'm probably gonna eat some lunch afterwards. And yeah, so let's see what this call is giving. I don't know if I'm gonna stay on the call for the whole time. I think the call is like 45 minutes. I gotta finish editing this vlog and getting this vlog up for y'all. So we shall see. Hydrogrip is really where it starts. And this is a silicone-free, alcohol-free, dimethicone-free primer that it has this gorgeous, like, everyone's in the chat, like, it's the best, we love Hydrogrip. So it has this really great, you know it, it has this great cooling kind of gel consistency. And not using any silicone in a primer is pretty much unheard of until we did it. And we love that because it's not gonna be comedogenic, it's not gonna break out your skin. What it's gonna do is grip on your makeup for up to 12 hours with that blue agave extract. Blue agave is comes from like cactuses, essentially. You might also know it from being in tequila. Shout out to Friday. Uh. All right, y'all, so I just finished that meeting and it was super cute. I learned a lot of good and cute makeup tips um, from the Milk Makeup team that actually have a new product launching next week, which is going to be a powder. So I'm super excited about that and to test and try that out. Um, I also got to see and get exposed to a lot of other influencers. This industry is so big yet so small at the same time. Um, and it's always amazing to see other people at different phases in this career journey. So I'm excited that I got to see everybody on that call and it was it was nice. Um, my connection was acting up so I had to log in on my phone. But overall, um, I think it was a great call and it was nice to put a face to the names and the emails that I've received from the Milk Makeup team. So if anyone from the Milk Makeup team is watching this, thank you so much for inviting me. That call was super dope um, and I'm excited that I got the opportunity to do that. Um, but yeah, y'all, it's time to start the weekend, child. Like I said, um, <laughs> I may or may not be going out of town tomorrow for the day. We gonna see, child. Like, <laughs> we gonna see. I don't want to say too much because y'all know I like to keep it cute, keep it private. But at the same time, I always want to be a source of inspiration and just re be realistic. Like, I have not dated in two years. Yeah, my last relationship ended in August of 2021. Um, and I've just been really doing my own thing. Um, you know, I've met some people here and there, but nothing that has made me want to stop and like actually give it time. Um, so yeah, I may be going on a date with somebody Sunday tomorrow. We'll see. If it's not giving, it's not giving. I'm not wasting my energy, effort, and gas. But if it does, then it does. That's the most I'm gonna say on that. Um, let me know how y'all dating life is going, if at all. I've heard the streets are very ghetto. I ain't been on the streets, so I can't say if it is or if it ain't. 
um, I've been in the house um, watching with a bird's eye view. Okay, <laughs> I don't have the time or the energy. But I mean, I may peek out and see what the streets is doing if I see something that is worth seeing. Okay, I love when people say it's good to see you. It's good to be seen and not view. Amen. <laughs> This is why I don't need to be dating because I'm, I'm 50 years old in my spirit, okay? Anyway, so I'll keep y'all updated on that. Uh, in next week's vlog, y'all will see if I go or if I don't. But <laughs> to be continue on the next Dragon Ball Z, okay? Uh, but thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this weekly vlog. Thank y'all for sticking with me, cooking with me, um, spending time with my family, all that good jazz. I am excited to see y'all next week's vlog. Please comment below your favorite part of the vlog. If you have multiple favorites, just keep commenting. I will literally respond to every single comment. So please be sure to like, subscribe, and comment how you feel in the comment section below. I'll always remember that I love you, God loves you more, and never, ever, ever forget to stay prayed up and stay motivated. And I will catch y'all in my next one. Bye, y'all.